I've been reading in the book of Deuteronomy. And in the beginning of the book, Moses is summarizing all the events from when Israel was taken out of Egypt up until this point. And he's talking about all these times where they either were not obeying God and they were complaining, or at points where they did do well and they did obey God. And in, this, in the beginning, God gives Israel a very important commandment in the beginning of Deuteronomy. And in chapter 6, verse 5 and 6, says, Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your strength. These words that I'm giving you today are to be in your heart. So we see God is communicating to Israel, you're to love me with all of your being. With every category of your life, you are to love me. And he's saying that because Israel at the time was still confused. They were still trying to worship after Egyptian gods. And really, on the surface, they're trying to love God. But everything beneath the surface, they weren't loving God with that. So what are some categories in your life that you are loving God well in? And those are victories we should celebrate. But also, we need to be looking at our lives and how we may not be loving God in categories. Like, for example, our thought life or maybe with our money, or things like that. Maybe with relationships. Are there people that we need to forgive or confess to? And so, search through our lives this week. As you're going about your day, search your life. Go through the categories and say, where am I honoring God? And praise God for where I am. But where am I not honoring God? And how how can I get that back on track? Remember that God loves you and there's grace for the categories where you're not. But let's get it back on track and let's love God with those.